check, check.
Lax fans, here we are at Carthage High School, home of the Carthage Comets. Carthage is the home team in the white jerseys playing against the visiting IHC Cavaliers. Cavaliers are in their blue jerseys. Cavaliers will be starting off going from right to left and the Comets going from left to right. Coming into this game, the Carthage Comets are having a... Uh, an even battle to the beginning of the year. They are three and four, and the IHC Cavaliers are 0 and five, but they have scored a couple of goals so far this season, so things are looking up. Officials having their meeting out at the center face-off position to go over whatever it is that officials go over with lacrosse players. Check and make sure their equipment is appropriate. Go over some ground rules. Play hard, run hard, run fast, pass, catch, throw, score. That's all I know. Lax to the max coming up here from Carthage, home of the Comets. You know that some boys look a little cold. The ones that don't look cold at all, we call hockey players. And they're doing just fine out there. These numbers are so far away. Taking the face off for Carthage. It looks like Zeb Stevens squaring off against somebody from IHC. Jacob Aminon, number 12. Look at him. Oh, he's a center in hockey. He's a center in Lacrosse battling for that puck on the far side. Connor Leduc. Leduc picks up with that long stick. It is, throws it into the middle to Amidon. Amidon drops that pass. It's just like he's playing hockey. Taking our puck. Uh, puck. Listen to me. Ball away is Carthage. Zeb Stevens coming up on the right side. Zeb hits that 40 yard line. Passes that ball into the box to Michael Ventiquatro. He's 2 4. So man, that is Ventiquatro, isn't it? Carthage going around on that far side. Sends that puck up. Ball. Would I say puck again? It's a very similar game. A little chilly. It takes a long time for me to make that transition. Cutting across Grant DeCobb. Dickob? I believe that. Puck, the ball coming across in the front shot, and it's a goal scored by Gage Marino. Marino? No, come on. Now we're making fun of me. <laughs> What are these, 15-minute quarters, right? So, t 12? Yeah. Wow, that was only 57 seconds, huh? Yeah. Felt like so much longer. So, Gage Marino scoring that goal, number 26, at 0.57 of the first quarter. Carthage leads 1-0. to zero. Battle for that ball. Trying to get scooped up by Kalel Tevaga, or Tevaga, if you want to make fun of me. <laughs> Battle ball on that far side. Near the sideline of a narrow football field because football field's not where men are made. Lacrosse, hockey, baseball, softball. That's right. Ball tossed up by the goalie, Connor Hickey. Hickey sends this up into that kid. Is that Ventra Quattro? No, it is 14. Zeb Stevens with that ball sends it up to Ventra Quattro. Ventra Quattro, it's got Cameron Dallin on him. Dallin just gently leaning his long stick on him. Doesn't do a whole lot at that. Can't break a nose by laying your stick on somebody's shoulder. Not that you want to break a nose, but you certainly want to make your presence felt. Look at that. Look at the attack there by Connor LaDuke. That's what you want to see. Ball comes over to Gage Marino. Marino coming out to the top again. Marino, top of the key, looking on deep left side. Throws that ball over to Evan Dickup. Dickup cutting back over into the middle. Dickup wants a goal of his own. Takes that shot. Misses wide left. And that's going to be a Carthage ball. Marcus Hickey, lone man back. Hickey picks that up underneath the uprights. Comes in, challenges Cameron Dallin, gets around him, turns, looks, shot, save made by the IHC goaltender, Braden Hanlon. Nice job by Braden. Getting his head in the game. Ball coming in, a ventral quattro takes it back behind Dallin. Knocks it loose. Dallin trying to scoop that ball up. Dallin. Still battling. He's got two on him. Loses that ball. Carthage picks it up. Comes out over into the middle. Grant Dickup drops that ball. Scooped up 
by IHC. IHC trying to drive that out. They'll do anything to move that ball out of their box. Not able to. Picked up by Evan Dickup. Dickup going back in behind. Dickup looking for somebody to pass to. Passes over to another Dickup. How many Dickups are on this team? Grant to Evan. Evan with it. No, Dickup. Grant Dickup with it now. Grant sends that ball across to Marino. Gage coming up on the right side. Shot just wide left, and that gets away. And who's closest to it this time? And it was, is Marcus Hickey again. Hickey from the O in Comets in the end zone. Coming up on that, that far right side, far left side. Sends this up on top. Wind up, shot, and save made by Braden Hanlon. Ball goes all the way in a deep. Backman Ventra Quattro, he's going to inbound that ball. Venture Quattro has LaDuke on him, sends that ball over onto the side, knocked down by Brendan Smith. Scooped up, Connor LaDuke. LaDuke pass out, missed pass, stolen by Gage Marino. Marino passes over, and that's another nice stop by Braden Hanlon. Hanlon sends this ball over onto the far side for LaDuke. LaDuke jogging his way up, looking around, cradling that ball off his right side. Cuts over to his left. Little short shovel pass to get it over to Austin Michaud. Michaud picks it up off the bounce, drives his way in. Did he hit the box? I don't think he did, did he? Now he went in. Ball scooped up by Charlebois. Charlebois battling, loses that ball. Grabbed now by Ben Ryer. Ryer has that knocked out, comes out of the box. Blocking that, trying to block it is Letier. Letier trying to scoop that forward and take it with him. His stick is all wrapped up, trying to kick it, doing anything with it. Coming out with that ball, Zeb Stevens. Stevens running up along the right side. Zeb hits that 30. Can't open, attempted by Mashad, not able to get it through. Ball comes out to Ventra Quattro. Ventra Quattro is going to choke up on that stick, look for somebody to pass to. Dishes that ball off at the top to Grant Dickham. Grant looking with that ball. It's already penetrated into the box, so he can take his time now. Gauging where he's going is Sam Charlebois. Throws that ball over to the left side. Evan Dickup with it. Evan coming across into the middle. Evan looking. Is he going to take a shot? He does low, and it's a goal scored by number 17, Evan Dickup. Time of that goal, 437. <laughs> So that's 2-0 now for the Carthage Comets. Leading scorer on the Comets is Caden Paquette with 11 goals. I have not seen him touch the ball yet. Driving in with this now is Core Murphy, and that's saved by Braden Hanlon. Ball comes out, scooped up by Cameron Dallin. Dallin going to try to use his speed. Runs right at uh, Kalel Tavaga, and Kalel Tavaga shows Cameron how to stick check to get the ball free. Ball comes out, taken away by Jacob Amidon. Amidon trying to gain control of it. Dallin trying to come back over, scooping that ball up. Trent Gardner. Gardner going wide left, dishes that ball forward over to Marcus Hickey. Hickey going in deep at the end line, going around back behind the goal. Sends this across to Ventra Quattro. Ventra Quattro looks out in front, tosses that ball to Carson Rick. Rick at the corner. Cuts into the middle. Carson Rick in at the slot. Top of the key goes to take that shot. Never leaves. Blocked by Connor LaDuke. Braden Hanlon trying to pick that ball up. And he does with that giant fishing net of his. Sends this over on his right side to Jordan McDonald. McDonald uses that extra long, long stick to pass this ball to the Comets. Caden Paquette. Here's their leading goal scorer. Ventra Quattro with it now. Ventra Quattro has Dallin. Dallin able to knock that ball free. Good job, Cameron. Ventra Quattro picks it back up, though, unfazed by the attack. Ventra Quattro coming over, sends his ball up to Liam Escudero. Escudero, that's a fun name to say. Escudero coming over into the middle. Sends that ball over to his far left side. They switch places, hustling in Trent Gardner. Gardner not able to get the shot off, gives, passes this off to Carson Rick. Rick zigzagging back. Rick being chased by Amidon. Passes this ball over to Escudero. Escudero coming back. Winds up. Shot. Save me. Braden Hanlon. Rebound comes out. Fighting with that ball is uh, Jordan McDonald. Not able to hold on to it. Trying to help out Connor Loving. 
Running after it, trying to scoop that ball up and knocking it out of play is Trent Gardner. It'll be an IHC ball in from the sideline. Jacob Amidon is going to take it. Amidon with that ball, running across, getting chased after by Caden Paquette. Amidon, nice check applied by Marcus Hickey. Amidon still with that ball. Amidon on the far side. He's got Kalel Tavaga on him. There he is. Drops that ball, scoops it back up again. Able to penetrate into... Oh, no, he didn't get into the box, did he? He was next to it, though. Next to it. Well, it looks like timeout called by IHC, which gives me timeout to tell you all about my favorite sponsors. Two Broke Moms, located on Main Street in Pulaski, next to the Chinese food restaurant across the street from the bank. Power Play Sports, exit 47 off Interstate 81 in Watertown. Dupree's Cleaning Services, interior and exterior cleaning for all of your residential, commercial, and industrial needs. Glory Construction and Development, if you're going to have it built, have it built in his glory. Sparks and Recreation and All Wheel Auto. The Guile Family, selling Subarus and other used vehicles at All Wheel Auto on Route 104 in New Haven, New York. You can follow them as they traverse all across the country, entering in Enduro races and all sorts of fun, traveling to Disney World and seeing all of the sights of this great country on Sparks and Recreation on YouTube. And Streamside RV Park and Golf Course, Tinker Tavern Road in Pulaski. That's Streamside. If you want to be Greenside, you got to be Streamside. And while you're there, go inside, get yourself something delicious to eat, cold to drink. Stop in at Divot's Bar and Restaurant. Located at Streamside RV Park and Golf Course, Route um, not 104. Where is it? What did I say? Sorry, let me fix my uh, scoreboard there. Yep, there, Tinker Tavern Road in Pulaski, and it is starting to rain on my camera. I wonder if that's waterproof. Probably not. Ball thrown in into the middle. Connor Loving loses it. Battle for that ball. No official turnover yet, and now it is Xavier Ixtalah. Oh, yeah. Number 15 picked that ball up. Now with it, Camden Dorchester. Dorchester sends this ball long out to Zeb Stevens. Zeb coming over on the near side. Zeb passes this ball up into the middle for Grant Dickup. Dickup cutting across east-west on that far side now, heading in deep into IHC territory. Throws that ball into the corner. Ball passed over near side to Ventra Quattro. Ventra Quattro gives it over to Gage Marino. Marino coming around up on top of the box now. Exits the box. Comes up by the center line. Being challenged by Connor LaDuke. Marino. Drops that ball off for Evan Dickup. Dickup coming in with some speed on the right side. He gets attacked by Amanon. Tries to get that shot off. Ball gets dislodged. And uh, we've got a violation of the crease, I believe. And so it'll be an IHC ball. <laughs> Brayden Hanlon wanted to pass that ball to Jacob Amidon, even if he was double teamed, instead of giving it to the two wide open guys off his right shoulder. Amidon penetrating in over the center line. Amidon, oh, we got a flag on the play. This is going to go against Carthage. And Amidon driven out of bounds. And we got a one-minute slash on number 30, Caden Paquette. Yep. Time of that penalty, 8.30, number 30. Caden Paquette, one minute for slashing. IHC with the ball. Ball goes over to Amidon. Amidon gives it to Loving. Loving sends this in to uh, Jason, Jameson Letier. Letier coughs this ball up. Scooped up, though, in deep by IHC. Can't tell who that is. Ball thrown over to Loving. Loving to Amidon. Amidon onto the right side. Back to Amidon from, I think it was Brendan Smith. Amidon over to Loving. Loving sends this in deep to Letier. Letier back to Loving. Loving. They're waiting for the perfect shot. In between the raindrops. Pass over to Loving. Loving to Letier. Letier. Nothing. Loving. 
Amidon. Amidon winds up, shot bouncing. That goes wide left. Closest to it is Jameson Letier, so he'll get the ball back. 11 seconds remaining in the player advantage for IHC. There's the clock stock ball. Comes back to Loving. Loving to Amidon. Amidon back to Loving. Loving winds up, sidearm shot. Save made by the netminder, Connor Hickey. Hickey passes ball up to Calhoun. I'm sorry, not Calhoun, wrong team. Zeb Stevens. Stevens over the center line. Stevens penetrates into the box by giving this ball to Ventra Quattro. Quattro back behind the net. Ball passed up on that far side. Winds up shot and a goal scored by number 10, Grant Dickham. Time of that goal, 9.48, and it is 3-0 in favor of the Carthage Comets. And give us another face-off at uh, the middle of the field, because that's where face-offs are taken. Battle for that ball comes back on Carthage's end, scooped up by Tavega. Tavega. Coming up on the right side, pass this ball in to Ventra Quattro. Still hasn't penetrated the box. Ventra Quattro attacked by Dallin. Now he's in the box. Ventra Quattro in deep back behind the goal. Dallin all over him, peppering him with that stick finally. Ventra Quattro, nice move to come around, makes his way in front, takes that shot, misses, goes out of play. Carthage going to retain possession of that ball. Carthage throwing this ball. Back in with it, Trent Gardner. Gardner cutting across the top of the box. Out in front, sends this ball onto the far side to Carson Rick. Rick comes back across. Rick winds up shot wide. Goes in a deep and out of play. Ball in deep at the corner. Now back behind. Marcus Hickey coming around on that far side. Hickey pass that ball up. Shot taken. Save made. Braden Hanlon. Running up with that ball on the far side. Austin Michaud. Michaud passes this ball back to Jordan McDonald. McDonald having a hard time catching this ball. McDonald picks it up. Maybe that stick's too big. McDonald on the far side, trying to weave his way around, gets his hand caught in the, the face mask of Paquette. Down he goes, and that's going to be a Carthage ball. Ventra Quattro with this ball, sends this towards the corner. Loses his stick. Marcus Hickey with it, passes this ball back to Escudero. Escudero cuts across the front. Driving in on the right side. Can't get in front of the net. Loses that ball. He's going to chase after it. Able to pick that ball up. Driven into the corner by Brennan Smith. Smith not able to keep up with him. Ball back behind the net now with Marcus Hickey. Hickey sends this up. Wind up shot. And a goal. Trent Gardner. It was 19 Trent Gardner assisted by number 8 Marcus Hickey. 19 from 8. Time of the Carthage Comets goal. 11 53. Seven seconds to go here in this first quarter. There's a faceoff. One by Carthage driving forward with it. Zeb Stevens. Stevens gets a shot off and scores with one second to go. So it is now 5-0 in favor of Carthage. And 
Here's the horn for the end of the first quarter. After one quarter of play here at the Carthage Varsity Field, it is 5-0 Comets over the Cavaliers. And we'll be back after this short intermission. face off. Sorry, I thought uh, intermission would be long enough for me to run my whole commercial there. Comet send this ball up on the near side. In the channel with that ball now is Grant Dickup. Dickup sends this up high to Evan Dickup. Evan back to Grant. Grant moving across, penetrates into the box. Grant, short pass to the top of the crease, touched forward by Caden Paquette, now scooped up by Braden Hanlon. Hanlon, with this ball, looking for somebody to pass. He's going to go for a long pass to Amadon. Amadon, not able to get it, taken away by uh, Jose Simo. And we've got a timeout by Carthage. All right, and that's the end of that timeout. Carthage getting their instructions. IHC ready. Get back into the defensive position as uh, it almost looks like fog. It's not. That's just water. Well, I guess fog is water too, isn't it? In a more vaporous form. This is water in its liquid form emanating from the skies. Advancing with the ball is Evan Dickup. Evan back to Grant. Grant looking, sends this over to the top of the box for uh, Greg Mar Mar Marino. Excuse me, Marino back to Dickup. Dickup penetrating in on the right side. Sends this in the back behind now on the far side. Scooting around with that ball. Pass over to uh, Ventra Quattro is missed. Ball taken by Jacob Amidon. Amidon has it knocked out, trying to clear it, not able to, unable to clear that ball. 
Caden Paquette trying to take it back now. Here's Connor LeDuc with it. Connor LeDuc running in. He's trying to penetrate into the box and does. LeDuc in, winds up, shovel backhand shot and a goal! Connor LeDuc! Connor LeDuc with the first goal for IAC. It is now 5-1. Ready for the faceoff. Amidon battling against Stevens. Amidon wins that the battle, trying to scoop that ball forward, goes back behind whoever number 31 is. I don't have that on my roster. What is it? So Connell Duke with this ball passes it over to Loving. Loving moving up. Drops this into the box for Trey Ledoux. Trey sends this back to Loving. Or Connor Leduc, excuse me. Leduc trying to uh, spin his way in uh, and not able to. Loses that ball and with the turnover, we'll get that push penalty. What are you looking for? Yeah, he's not there. No, 31. Yeah, 31 red. Protest, I'll protest. <laughs> Amadon with this ball passes it over for Jose Simo. Simo having a hard time grabbing it, but does. Simo to Ledoux. Trey back to Simo. Simo sends this out to the uh, just outside of the box for Amidon. Amidon passes over to Loving. Loving sends this in deep for Letier. Letier grabs this at the corner. Letier back to Loving. Loving to Amidon. Amidon looking. Comes over. Passes it over to Simo. Simo to Ledoux. Ledoux back to Amidon and uh, hustling in is, San is Sanders. But Amidon with this ball back over for Simo. Bad pass. Gets away. Taken over by Carthage. Here comes Grant Dickup hustling down the field. Dickup sends this forward. Shot taken by Marcus Hickey. Blocked right in front. Hickey driving his coverage to the ground. As Kadera goes down, that's a turnover. And now IHC with this ball. Paul gets passed up to Austin Mashad. Mashad tries sending this forward for a, a cutting Who's that cutting? A cutting Simo, but it gets picked off by Carthage. Pass all the way up to Marcus Hickey. Hickey in the channel now, trying to break into the box and does. There he is, touches that box, rolls back out, gives this ball to Carson Rick. Rick moving up at the corner of the box, looking for something. How's he going to start this play? He's going to start off by giving it to Trent Gardner and say, Trent, you figure something out. Gardner's going to hustle into the channel on the left side. Looks at the official, comes back, looks for his coverage. Runs by Amidon over to the top, passes off to Quattrovino. Quattrovino on that far side at the crease. Shot goes wide, bounces, and gets back. Far man back. Marcus Hickey off the X is going to play this ball. <laughs> ball goes all the way back, picked up by Ventra Quattro. Sometimes called Quattro Vino. Depends on uh, how much you've had to drink on the way over, I guess. <laughs> that's, that's what I hear. <laughs> Connor LeDuc in the corner. Shovels this ball back over. Gets into the crease. And I see picking it up. There's Cameron Dallin with this ball. Dallin passes this ball up for Jordan McDonald. McDonald with it. Cuts it over to Loving and drops off. Loving sends this in deep. Comes back to Amidon. Amidon in the top of the box. Curling around. He's getting peppered by number 31. A legitimate 31. We just call him Illy. Amidon driving in. In deep. Pushed off by Chris Ellis. Amidon in a deep back behind the net now. 
Pass this ball over to Letier. Letier sends this up high for Loving. I think it's Loving. Yep, Loving passes over into the middle for Charlebois. Charlebois driving forward back to Loving. Loving curling over, ne approaching the top of the crease, knocked back by Escudero. Loving still looking for a way to get in and get a shot off. Decides to cough this ball up to Escudero. He moved closer to the goal, not close enough. Escudero picks it up, comes back the other way, breaks over the center line. Escudero able to clear and get into that box, drives that ball up to Ventra Quattro. Ventra Quattro in a back behind the goal, goes over to the X, cuts around on the near side, looking for somebody to drive to, comes around, takes the shot himself, and scores. Michael Ventra Quattro. Time of that goal, 5.30. And it is a 6-1 game in favor of the Carthage Comets. Oh, there's a shot that I totally missed. I was just told, though, number 31 is Jacob Kilborn. So that was a Carthage goal scored by number eight, Marcus Hickey, assisted by number three, Corey Murphy, eight from three, time of the Comets goal, 5.37. They win this face off, drive that ball in, pass up, short shot taken, Caden Paquette with the goal. That was Paquette from Hickey, 30 from 8. Time of that goal, 5.44. Well, that's three goals in 14 seconds. At this rate, I'm never going to get dinner. <laughs> off the faceoff, taking this ball forward. Murphy, Murphy passes it off. To Hickey, to Paquette again, and somebody's padding their numbers. <laughs> from eight, from three, and it's a timeout IHC. So that was goal scored by number 30, Caden Paquette, assisted by number eight, Marcus Hickey. And if we were to go to assists, which we don't, it would be from number three, Corey Murphy. Okay, so it is 9-1 in favor of the Carthage Comets. IHC baiting them into comfort so they can unleash their comeback. <laughs> Trying to lull them into a false sense of security. Here's the face-off. Again, this is won by Corey Murphy. Murphy passed this ball up to Marcus Hickey. Hickey. Opts not to get another assist right away. Drops his ball back to Carson Rick. Rick at the corner of the box, jogging, looking to see which way he's going to make this play. Guarding him is Amidon. Rick comes over to the top. Now takes that shot, and it bounces over the goal. It's going to go out of play, grabbed by Marcus Hickey. Last man back.
Hickey's guarded by Brendan Smith. Smith putting some pressure on him. Hickey coming around on the near side, sends this ball up top to Escudero. Escudero loses it momentarily, regains control, curls around outside of the box. He's got Sam Charlebois guarding him. Escudero looking, trying to deke out Charlebois. Charlebois not having anything to do with it, keeping him out to the corner of that box. Escudero trying to penetrate in, weaves one way, cuts back the other, almost had it, loses his footing. Slippery when wet out there. Ball comes up to the top for Carson Rick. Rick trying to roll off of Aminon, not able to break in. Rick passes this ball over to Trent Gardner. Gardner on the right side. Gets around his man. Oh, can opener attempted. Able to dislodge that ball. Not the stick, though. Picked up by Hickey. Hickey throws over to Escadero. Escadero thought about popping in to take that shot. Offs to give it back to Carson Rick instead. Rick around on the right side. Aminon coming over to close that gap. Pass goes back to Hickey. Back behind the net. Hickey from the X. Coming around on the near side. Forced wide by Brendan Smith. Sends this ball out to the... Uh, outside of the box to Escadero. Escadero's got Cameron Dallin on him. Dallin trying to get that stick on him. Almost lets Escadero go by. Escadero unleashes that shot, gets away. Closest to it, again, Marcus Hickey doing his job playing the X. Hickey coming in. Oh, it's not Hickey. You're right. Good eye. Carson Rick rolling off of Amidon, or not Rick, was that you, Haas? Somebody from IHC's got that ball. Ill-advised short pass, gets it to Amidon. Amidon coughs it up to Ventra Quattro. Ventra Quattro takes out his player with that ball still. Forced out of the box by Connor LaDuke. Ventra Quattro going over to the right side. Still inside the box, gets by LaDuke. LaDuke almost able to knock him down, still has that ball. Passes it too high for Hickey, goes out of play. That's going to be an IHC ball. Cameron Dallin's going to go back to pick up a ball. Dallin with the ball now, shooting up alongside his own defensive box. Coming over to attack is Juhas. Juhas able to get that ball, gets it free. Cameron Dallin trying to battle back to... Regain control. Ball is still loose. Scooped up by Jacob Kilborn. Kilborn loses it. Trey Ledoux has it. Trey passes this ball over for Amidon. Amidon not able to grab it. He's trying to swat at it. Looks like he's playing hockey. Just swinging his stick blindly in the air. Ball comes back over to Marcus Hickey. Hickey pushed towards the side by Smith. Gets around Smith. Not able to get his lane to the goal, though. Hickey going back to the X. Hickey. Not quite to the X. Coming up on the near side. Roll it out top. Shot. Goal. Scored Marcus Hickey. Carthage goal scored by number eight, Marcus Hickey. Time of the Comets goal, 9-0-2. And they lead by a narrow margin of 10-1. Corey Murphy lining up for Carthage. Down low battle, pops that ball forward, gets it by LaDuke. LaDuke knocks it free, though. Scoops that ball, takes it back the other way. It gets knocked out. LaDuke, yard sale on. And it's Carthage ball. Zeb Stevens advancing forward. Zeb passes this ball all the way up to Paquette. Caden Paquette over on the far side. Paquette going up and back. Has Dallin on him. Sends this ball over to Evan Dickup. Dickup getting played on by Austin Michaud. Austin still there. Setting the pick is Gage Marino. Ball gets passed over to Grant Dickup. Grant comes around using the body of his brother as a blocker. Takes that shot. Save me to Braden Hanlon. Ball goes back. Covered by Hickey. Not Hickey. Normally he's back there, but in this case, it's Michael Venture Quattro. I don't know what that is. False start? I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. It's a turnover penalty. That's all I know. Cameron Dallin using all the speed he's got, cradling with that ball, passes it over to Loving. Loving with it now. Loving gives it to Amadon. Amadon. 
now breaks the box. Thank you. Amidon, shot, hits the leg of Austin Mashad, and Stop Mashad gets up, takes the shot, and scores! Austin Mashad. Mashad. That's how I'm saying it. Right, I could have been Mead. <laughs> oh, they can hear me. <laughs> Amidon with the ball. Getting pressured, loses it. Ball gets dropped out, scooped up by Gage Marino. Marino trying to drive forward. Connor LeDuc knocks it free. LeDuc in possession, gets this to Amidon. Amidon hustling to the box, breaks the box. Attack Mage, passes that ball over for uh, Simo. Not able to keep it as he got checked. Goalie ball tosses it up for Gage Marino. Marino on that far side, approaching the corner of the box and is in. Marino, long pass to Grant Dickup. Dickup, long pass over to Evan Dickup. Evan, short pass into Ventra Quattro, or Quattro, Ventra Quattro. Four wines and a ball, that's all I know. Save made by Braden Hanlon. IHC coming back on the far side. Cameron Dallin using his speed. He's probably not even out of breath, a punk. Takes that shot, save made by Connor Hickey. Ball sent out, almost stolen. Staying with it, though, Grant Dickup. Grant into the box. Now curls around. He's going to get something set up. Gives this ball over to Evan. Evan Dickup looking. Got 20. Seconds remaining now. Evan Dickup with the ball. Looking to make two shots. He passes it over to Gage Marino. Marino sends this in. Knocked free. Ventra Quattro with that ball. From the X. Loses it. Coming over to steal that ball. Scoop it up. Trying to grab it. Sam Charlebois not able to. Now battling Brendan Smith. Charlebois. Smith. Ventra Quattro pulls it away. And that's the end of the half. After one half, it is 10 for Carthage. 2 for IHC. We'll be back in uh, just a few minutes.
Lacrosse fans, we are back. Second half about to begin. Third quarter coming right up. Carthage Comets lead the IHC Cavaliers by a score of 10 to 2. Comets are ready. Officials are ready. Cavaliers are now ready. Connor LaDuke trotting out to take the face off. He is squaring off against, it looks like Zeb Stevens out there. There's the faceoff. Stevens driving LaDuke back, picks up that ball. Stevens passes that ball in. Uh, he's in the channel. Um, Marcus Hickey. Hickey breaks the box. Pass that ball back out to Grant Dickham. Grant to Evan. Evan drops that ball, trying to get it back up, battling for Austin Michaud. Evan uh, gets a control again. Now he's being attacked by Connell LaDuke. Evan Dickham coming across in the faceoff circle. Now driving back into the box. Evan Dickham coming wide right, forced outside of the box by Connell LaDuke, looking for somebody to pass to. Evan Dickham coming back out to the top of the box, now cutting across into the middle. Evan still looking. Connor trying to drive him back, passes that ball over to Grant. Grant Dickham from the corner. He's getting attacked now by Austin Michaud. Grant penetrating into the box, takes that shot, and scores Grant Dickham with a goal. Carthage goal scored by number 10, Grant Dickub. Time of the goal, 0-49, and they lead now by 11-2. Only by 11-2. They lead by 9. The score is 11-2. English. It's my first language. Connor LaDuke again facing off against Zeb Stevens. Connor drips back. Let's Zeb get that ball. Zeb comes over, gets around Connor. Connor whacking at him with that long stick of his. Drives that ball into Venta Quattro. Venta Quattro hits that box, drops out, gives this ball back over to Gage Marino. Marino taking his time, sends this all the way across outside to Grant Dickup. Dickup going over onto the far side at the channel area. Dropping, he's actually inside the box, coming over towards the middle. Getting attacked by McDonald. Takes that pass over to uh, Marino, Greg Marino. Gage Marino, even, if you want to call him by his real name. Passes this ball over to Evan Dickham. Evan, cutting across at the top, poked out by Connor LaDuke. Passes this ball over to Grant. Grant Dickham coming back. Gives this back over to Evan. Evan trying to drive in. Connor cutting off his lane. Evan Dickham back out into the top. He's free. He's open. He shoots. He scores. Evan Dickham. Carthage Comets goal scored by number 17, Evan Dickub. Time of the Comets goal, 1-5-0. So we're just correcting the clock back. Is there runtime in Varsity Lacrosse? Ten ten. Yeah, close enough. <laughs> There's the face off. Zeb Stevens driving forward. Zeb staying wide, Amadon peppering at him, almost got it. Cameron down, he gets beat. Zeb passes this ball out in front. There's a shot and a goal, Marcus Hickey. Eight from 14 on that one. So, Marcus Hickey, number eight, assisted by number 14, Zeb Stevens. Time of that goal, 2-14. It is now 13-2. Amadon's going to face off against Zeb again. He's got Austin Mashad to his right, Connor LaDuke to his left in the offensive end. We've got uh, Trey LaDuke. Kalel Tavaga, and I can't see the other kid.
Well, let's go back to the defensive end, though. Comets with this ball. Ventra Quattro coming around on the near side. Ventra Quattro sees an opening. Oh, offs the comeback. Sends this ball outside of the box to Grant Dickup. Dickup sends this ball over to Evan. Dickup. Evan. Winds up. Shot. Save me to Braden Hanlon. Hanlon using all of his four seconds. Sends this ball over to Cameron Dallin. Dallin catches this ball, drives forward, passes out to the middle, not able to get it to Amadon. It was a short pass. Scooping it is Kalel Tavaga. Turned over back there. Peppering, scooping it up. Uh, Jose Simo, Simo, not able to get that shot off, and that ball gets covered up by Connor Hickey. Driving down with this ball, Grant Dickup. Dickup knocked down by Connor LeDuc. Nice check. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. As a flag goes into the air to push on Connor LeDuc, it'll be a white ball. So it's a penalty on Connor LeDuc. 30 second technical at 333 for a push on Connor LeDuc, number four for IHC. Carthage with this ball. Dickup on the far side. Evan Dickup sends this in deep to Marcus Hickey. Hickey across now comes out to Ventra Quattro. Fakes the shot, drops this ball back to uh, uh, Marino. Now in a deep on the right side, Grant Dickup. Dickup sends this ball across, comes back out for Stevens. Takes that low shot and scores. Zeb Stevens with the goal. All right. Here's the face off. Amadon almost had it. Ball's loose in no man's land. Still battling for it, and uh, it crosses over the 30 still. And now it gets knocked out. That's going to be a Carthage ball. Waiting for the Carthage player to get the ball, and now he does. Ben Clarkson's going to inbound that ball. Clarkson passes it off to the goalie, Connor Hickey. Connor looking back to Clarkson. Ben Short pass, knocked free. Connor LeDuc trying to get it loose. Letier scoops his ball up. Letier running into trouble along the sideline. He's still got some space. Now he loses it. LeDuc using the hip. Nice job, Connor LeDuc scooping that ball up. Short pass over to Amanon. Amanon can't catch it, grabbing it though on the far side. Is that Trey? Trey LeDuc winds up, takes that shot. Save made by Connor Hickey. Hickey passed that ball out, moving with it. Liam Escudero. Escudero, nice move to evade Letier. Escudero in the middle over the center line. Now he drops that ball up, penetrates, breaks the box. With it, Marcus Hickey. Marcus curling around. In it deep back, forced back by the X. Brandon Smith all over him, comes around, shoots, and scores. Marcus Hickey. Time of that goal, 6.02. Face off. Coming up. Amadon and Zeb Stevens. Oh, thank you. Is that Zeb? No, it was not Zeb. That was Corey Murphy. And that's going to be a Carthage ball. Murphy scoops that ball up, starts driving forward. Going to have a whistle. He's got to come back and start from the middle. Just because the ball rolled its way to the 40 doesn't mean you can run up and scoop it and start from there. 
So restarting, Trent Gardner with the ball now. Trent Gardner passes this over, and IHC able to steal it away. Connor LaDuke using that long stick to keep that ball high up in the air. LaDuke going in. He's in the box, winds up, shot. Save made by Connor Hickey. Connor to Connor. Now Connor passes this ball all the way out to uh, Carson Rick. Rick drops that ball off, and it's taken away. On the far side, Jordan McDonald. McDonald with this ball sends it over for Letier. Jamison trying to make his move. Letier coming over at the corner of the box. Letier sends this outside at the top of the box for Austin Michaud. 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 How do I say we say his name? <laughs> Michaud. Yeah. Amidon with it. Passes it over to Loving. Loving at the top to Michaud. Michaud. Winds up, sends this over, back to Loving, Loving looking, Loving looking, Loving Lee. It's the only way he's got. Sends this ball over to Austin Mashad. Mashad. Oh, tried getting it to Charlebois. It gets picked off by Carson Rick. Rick coming back with this ball. Rick looking downfield. He's driven over to the side, stays inbound, sends this over into the box, gets scooped up in the middle there by Juhas. Juhas loses this ball, scooped up, goes into the crease, picked up by Braden Hanlon. Hanlon to LaDuke. LaDuke on the far side. Sends this ball up for uh, Loving. Loving trying to play it off the bounce, running into Colel Tavaga. Tavaga takes it away, passes this ball over to Zeb Stevens. Stevens makes his move to get by Letier. Stevens in the middle now. Stevens passes this ball over to Trent Gardner. Gardner on the far side. Gardner challenged by LaDuke, sends this ball up for Caden Paquette. Paquette back to Gardner. Gardner, one handling that ball, holding it out, trying to keep it on the far side from Connor LaDuke. Comes over into the middle, LaDuke gets that stick around, dislodges that ball, scooped up by Cameron Dallin. Dallin running with this ball, passes it over onto his right side to Amidon, I think. Nope, 14, Max Calhoun. Calhoun coming up. Shot uh, through the air. How pretty was that? Save made. Wound up, shot right into the big basket of Connor Hickey. Hickey sends this long. Bouncy bounce once, twice, three, 15. Scooped up by Calhoun. Paquette sends this across, goes off of Escudero, but picked up by number zero. Yeah, <laughs> microphone still on. <laughs> Gavin Anderson with this ball. Anderson going in deep, forced back there by LaDuke. Anderson at the X, coming around on the far side, trying to find, penetrate in front of the net. Comes out the long way. Anderson at top. Anderson wants the pass. Gets his ball over to Escudero. Escudero comes back. Anderson catches his breath. Escudero winds up, shot, bounce. Initial save made and recovered by Braden Hamlin. Hamlin passes ball too high for Cameron Dallin. And that's going to be a Carthage ball over on the side with a minute and a half to go in this third quarter. Anderson coming to pick this ball up. Right, zero. Ames. Ames with the ball. Number zero. Sends this ball over into the middle for Evan Dickup. Dickup gives it. To Trent Gardner, Gardner back to Dickup, Dickup back to Gardner, Gardner winds up, shot, save made, a Braden Hanlon. Hanlon, short pass to Amadon, Amadon's going to run this right up the middle. Forced wide by Caden Paquette, still with this ball, gets attacked by Tanner Juhas, Amadon still with it, breaks the box. Amadon going in deep. Amidon coming around back behind at the X. Amidon may be getting confused as to the object of the game. It's time to take a shot, get this ball out there. Amidon riding around onto the side, throws this all the way back, scooped up by Charlebois. Charlebois from the X, passes this ball up high, intended for Letier, picked off though by Ben Clarkson. Blen Clarkson coming up with this ball. Ben. Driving his way in, hits Cameron Dallin, passes it over to Paquette. Paquette turns, wind shot, and a goal! 30 from 35. At 11.53, it's another 
Carthage goal. And after three quarters of play, Carthage leads by a score of 16 to 2. we go fourth quarter 12 minutes to go battling for that face off Zeb Stevens and he comes away with it Zeb's got Leduc on him now Amadon Zeb still with it had penetrated the box now passes his ball over to Carson Rick Rick sends this out up on top everybody misses it and that's an up and back that's going to be IHC ball right But it, it was a whistled play, though, right? Because it got sent back over the line for, by Carthage, so he should have blown the whistle to stop play. Hmm? No? I don't know. Somebody's complaining about something. Yeah. Ball sent forward by Jameson Letier. Letier loses it. Escudero comes back with it. Escudero running up with that ball on the far side, cutting over into the middle. Passes ball over to Carson Rick. Rick sends it in deep. Back to Rick it comes. Rick not able to get that ball. Scooping it up, Trent Gardner. Gardner loses it, regains control. Gardner loses it again, regains control, and... No, and didn't he just step over the 50 again? Is it both feet or just one? Uh, well, apparently in this game, it's just one if you're leading by 14. Sliding around with this ball, number 21. I don't know who that is. Who is that? Gavin Hall. Gavin Hall. And Gavin Hall with the goal. So that goal scored by number 21, Gavin Hall of Carthage. Comets. Another face off. Amidon battling. Ball's loose. Tied up with Zeb Stevens. Stevens drifts back to scoop that ball up. Challenged by Amidon running up behind him, though, was Jameson Letier. Stevens sends his ball forward. And they've broken the box. Back at the X with that ball is Gavin Hall. Hall. Passes this ball over to Trent Gardner. Gardner on the near side, getting attacked by Connell Duke. Hall makes his way towards the goal shot, save made. Rebound goes back behind the net, picked up. Gavin Hall, Hall coming around near side, shot, save made. Braden Hanlon. 
Hanlon with the ball now. He's looking. He ought to take a shot from there. Pass that ball off to Cameron Dallin. Dallin on the far side. He's going to outrun one player. He's going to outrun two players. Cameron Dallin going into a thick of three players. Pass this ball off to Trey Ledoux. Ledoux pass over for Jamison Letier. Letier couldn't catch it. Ball goes all the way down to the corner and out. That's going to be a Carthage ball because that was a missed pass, not a missed shot. Got under nine minutes of play to go here in the, this game. Carthage leads by the narrow margin of 17-2. to two. It's anybody's game here still. Carthage coming back with this ball. With it, Trent Gardner. One-handed being pushed to the outside by Austin Mashad. Ball gets passed and missed. That's going to be an IHC ball. Coming up with this ball, Jordan McDonald. McDonald passes it to LeDuc. LeDuc trying to run away from Carson Rick. Rick runs into his teammate, Juhas. Ball gets passed up, turned over. Here's Escudero. Escudero on the far side trying to stay away. Connor LeDuc trying to drive him back outside of the box and does. LeDuc forces Escudero all the way behind. There's a jab. Comes around, tries to can open. He can't get that uh, stick inside his arms there. Escudero stops, curls back. LeDuc, little another push. LeDuc staying on Escadero. Escadero come around. Now he gets around. It goes in, and uh, Mashad drops him, drops him down to the ground. Ball comes free, and there's the flag. Two. Yeah, that other thing that Connor did wasn't allowed, huh? So we've got two penalties on IHC. Number four, Connor LeDuc, one minute for a slash. And number 11, Austin Michaud, 30 seconds for technical for a push. I have no idea what time that penalty was at. With a running clock, it's probably expired by now. So I don't know what the heck is going on. It'll be 30 seconds from whenever, or a minute from whenever. And there we go. It's 7.05 to go. So those penalties allegedly at 455. Ball comes in with Carthage. Escadero sends this ball in deep to Carson Rick. Rick from the X passes this ball up for Gardner. Trent Gardner winds up shot and a goal. Goal scored by number 19, Trent Gardner. Time of the goal, 5-18. Comets lead 18-2. Corey Murphy's going to take the face off for Carthage. Jacob Amidon coming over for IHC. Here's the face off. Murphy pushes this ball forward, coming over to try to grab it as well. Caden Sanders scooped up by Jacob Kilborn. Kilborn with this ball. Jacob looking. He's got another one coming on. He gets attacked from two sides. Still with this ball, though. Oh. No, it's a penalty on, I don't know, whatever. Some sort of infraction on White. I don't know what it was. Running too far, perhaps. Five and a half minutes to go. Oh, no. Oh, he's on blue, which makes more sense. Why they stopped it, though, for Jacob Kilborn to leave the field instead of running with the ball is beyond me. So, Carthage ball. Five minutes to go. Here's Ames taking this ball in. Sends this into the corner. Carthage back behind the net from the X. Coming out with it, Gavin Hall. Hall passes ball over to Escadero. Escadero coming out, 
Towards the top of the box, in the middle, driving forward, in shot, save made, Braden Hanlon. Hanlon looking, passes this ball over short to Jordan McDonald. McDonald coming up with this ball, sends this all the way across the field for Cameron Dallin. Dallin's going to try to make his break down. Dallin passes this over into the box. I don't know what that whistle was for. Here comes Carthage. Hmm? I don't know. You know, I didn't count quick enough. That could have been it. Ames sends this ball into the corner. Carthage. Gavin Hall back behind at the X now. Gavin Hall coming over, looking to Escadero. Passes it to him. Escadero with this ball. Walking gingerly forward, ever so softly. LeDuc trying to push him away, trying to dislodge that ball. Ball gets passed over to Ames. Ames coming over into the middle, winds up, shot bounce. Tipped away, now it's free, it's loose, and now it's scooped up by Braden Hanlon. Hanlon looking. Pass this ball out to Cameron Dallin. Dallin moving forward with this ball, onsides. Cameron in deep. Cameron breaks the box himself. Winds up. Shot low and wide. Goes all the way back. And I think, I think, I think Simo. I thought Simo was closest. Oh, they think so too. I hate C ball. James Jameson Lettieri with this ball. Lettieri coming around. Sends this back out up on top for Amadon. Amadon. Into the box, driving his way through, into the middle, gets pushed off. Not able to get that shot off. Nice defense by Chris Ellis. Oh, I guess it wasn't nice defense by Chris Ellis because they called him for it. You can't do that. But it worked. <laughs> Timeout IHC, perhaps? which gives me another opportunity to thank my sponsors. Without them, I couldn't do what I do. All of this equipment costs money, and it's money I don't have. So, Two Broke Moms, Main Street in Pulaski, Power Play Sports, Exit 47 off Interstate 81 in Watertown, Dupree's Cleaning Services, ExteriorCleaning315.com, Glory Construction and Development, Sparks and Recreation on YouTube, All Wheel Auto, Route 104 in New Haven, New York, Streamside RV Park and Golf Course, that's Tinker Tavern Road in Pulaski, and Divot's Restaurant and Bar, located at Streamside on Tinker Tavern Road in Pulaski. That is exit 35 off Interstate 81, head east. If you want to be Greenside, you got to be Streamside. Here's IAC off that timeout. Pass comes back out to Connor Loving. Loving sends it to Amadon. Amadon gives it to Charlevoix. Charlevoix sends this ball up, comes right back to him. Amadon to Loving. Loving to Ledoux. Ledoux looking. Gives it back to Loving. Loving to Amadon. Amadon to uh, Charlevoix. Charlevoix sends that ball up to... Uh, Who's that? Oh, Letier. Back over to Loving. Trey Ledoux with this ball. Gives it to Amadon. Amadon. Back to Ledoux. Oh, Ledoux. Hard time. The ball got tipped. He almost caught it, though. Loving recovers. Got less than two minutes to go. Loving gives it to Ledoux. Ledoux has got uh, Letier on the far side. Back post. Ball sent over to Amadon. Amadon. To Charlebois, Charlebois across to Loving, Loving looking to Ledoux, Ledoux in the middle, and Letier gets uh, Letier. Who's that? That gets taken out. Charlebois, Charlebois, no Mashad gets taken out. IHC ball from the side. Ledoux comes over, brings this ball in, tries to give it back to Mashad, and he gets absolutely pancaked, and Ledoux's gonna get it again. Ledoux to Loving. Loving. Getting pushed out by Tavaga. Tavaga all over Loving. Loving still with it. Gets it to Amadon. Amadon, hard time catching this ball. Recovers. That's not Amadon. That is Charlebois. Recovers. Charlebois has that ball taken away by Xavier. How 
It's Extwala. All right. Ball sent in deep with that ball now is Gavin Hall. Hall at the far corner. has got Cameron Dallin on him. Cameron forcing him all the way to the end line. Ball gets passed over to Carson Rick. Rick coming up on the near side. Less than 30 seconds to go. Carson Rick passed this ball up for Trent Gardner. Gardner into the middle to Ames. Ames curling around. Shot misses. And that's going to be... Yeah, that's Carthage ball. I, I thought he pointed like it was IHC's ball, and that didn't make sense to me at all. Seven seconds, six seconds, five seconds, no seconds. That's the game. It's a close, hard-fought battle. Carthage Comets come out, eking their way out on top. Score is 18-2 to two in favor of the Comets. Another great game here at the Carthage High School, home of the Carthage Varsity Comets. This one ends in an 18-2 victory. Carthage over IHC. I am the Dan Dallin reminding you, don't wait for it to be a good day. Make it a great day, everyone.